Hi, my name's Tom Covey, and I'm a sales support engineer here at Sony Professional Solutions of America. In this video, I'll be showing you how to create effects on Sony's new AnyCast Touch live content producer. The AnyCast Touch provides a series of effects templates for the creation of different picture-in-picture -picture effects. These are accessed via the option window on the main touch panel by tapping on the effect bar. The effect templates are displayed. Tap on one of the templates to select it. The effect will then appear in the next window. It's important to note that the two top templates with arrows, as well as the chroma key effect below, can be moved and sized. The other templates are fixed. If you select a template with arrows, changes to the effect are made on the subpanel via the effect tab. Simply tap and drag the circle icon to position the picture. Select small, medium, or large to resize the picture. Chroma key adjustments are also performed on the subpanel using the effect tab. To determine the source to fill into each effect window, return to the option tab by tapping the back arrow at the top of the option window. You'll see a representation of the effect in the option window on the effect bar. Tap the number icon to define which source to select. If there are multiple windows in the effect, tapping repeatedly on the number icon will cycle through the various windows, allowing each to be selected in turn. Once you've selected the desired window, select a video source from the input tab. To remove an effect, Tap and hold on the blue portion of the Effect icon in the Option tab and select Remove from the contextual menu. Alternatively, there's a Remove option labeled Off at the top of the Effects selection window. Tap on Take to remove the effect from the program output. That's all for now. I hope you found this tutorial on creating effects with the AnyCast Touch enjoyable and helpful. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.